Ten. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento with the uh, two o'clock update here for three o'clock update for TFNN. And uh, what I want to mention to you, folks, is that uh, the stock indices were sharply lower this morning. We were down about uh, 50 handles in the S&P. Dow Jones was down 300. It rallied back to be up on the day. The NASDAQ is still slightly lower. Treasury bonds are still up. We had a big reversal in gold. It dropped from that $2,000 $2, level all the way down to drop $30 down to 1975. Uh, Last I saw, it was trading around 1980 or something like that. So that's a reversal. Uh, crude oil was down uh, $3, uh, almost $3 a barrel. It rallied back to almost uh, unchanged on the day. It's still down a little bit, but you know, gained a lot of it back. So all of these things are very volatile, and volatility is the name of the game these days, folks. And that's what you like to see. Now, there's one other thing that you got to remember, folks, that there's a banking, supposedly a banking crisis out there. So watch the banks. Because if this banking crisis is really over, you're going to see the banks start to rally. Banks like uh, J.P. Morgan, Morgan Stanley, Goldman Sachs will be the first ones to rally. Then the weaker banks like Citicorp and Bank of America. Bank of America, of course, being the weakest. If they start to rally, that would be enough to sell to help people come in and to start to buy stuff. I, I think they will because the market's extremely oversold. We've been down here for a couple of weeks from that high we made way back here on March the 6th. So that's what I'm looking at. I'm watching the banks, but they, they go down every day. I mean, so there's still a banking crisis out there. And how big it's going to be, if it does, in fact, I don't know. But Deutsche Bank, a large German bank, uh, was down 12% at one time today. I don't know how it ended up. But uh, those are things that you pay attention to because, you know, you don't want to be surprised. You know, these banks that went under, they were going down for a year long before they went bankrupt, folks. So look at the price if you happen to be in a bank. And if it's been dropping, be careful. Be very careful because you don't know what's been happening on the inside. Somebody's been selling that stuff. It certainly hasn't been me because I don't trade stocks. But somebody was selling it. I mean, all these things have been down for a long time. You know, the, the investment banks, Morgan Stanley, Goldman Sachs, they're okay. Have a wonderful weekend. Live every day in an attitude of gratitude, and may God bless.